everyone, it's Happy Mail Queen. I'm back and I have another haul for you guys. I was able to go out um, over the weekend and I had to run some errands and um, I was able to stop by Frank Garcia Studios. So I'm, I was super excited because I've been itching to go there again um, for some Christmas crafty items. So, all right, let me go ahead and start with the gingerbread kisses um 12 by 12 papers from doodlebug i know you guys have all seen this already by now because a lot of you guys um have been um doing haul videos um sharing this paper collection it is so cute i didn't go crazy i only got a few things in fact i wasn't even gonna get the 12 by 12 um papers but they didn't have the six by six that's the one i wanted but frank ran out because you guys all bought it <laughs> so you didn't leave me any anyway I was a little late so <laughs> um so yeah I decided to just get the 12 by 12 and then a couple of other things so um I'll show you really quick but isn't this so adorable this is um baking spirits bright and the reverse looks like that. So I'll, I'll go over it really quickly because you guys have all seen this, right? <laughs> Pretty much. Um, this is um, the second one here, which is called Gingerbread Kisses. And this reminds me of another paper um, collection from Doodlebug. And that's another reason why I didn't go crazy and get a bunch of uh, papers and, you know, uh, embellishments because let me show you this side um, I still have some from last year and um, some of them you know remind me of this collection so I'm sure I can mix and match isn't that cute look at the little houses oh my gosh you could even fussy cut those so cute so this is the um, what did I say this one it's called gingerbread kisses that's what this one's called Okay, and then we have uh, Mary and Bright, and that's the pattern, and then you have the, you know, the bigger stripes, and again, this is the 12 by 12. I was able to get a discount. I did get 10% off, so um, yay look at this one so pretty this one is called deck the halls oh and in the back it has the cut aparts that you can use for like journaling for your list for your planners or whatnot your December daily so cute the little gingerbread love it and then this one is great for the December daily because it actually has the countdown um, to Christmas, right? Oh, but there's no 25. Why is that? <laughs> um, I'm not sure why. But anyway, so cute. And the reverse side is the polka dots. And this is kind of a reddish uh, pink. It's not like really red. It's kind of pinkish. And then you have this one here, which is the berry floral. And then the reverse side has the tone-on-tone uh, tone, uh hearts pink hearts this one is another cut apart it's holiday sprinkles and you get all those three by four cut aparts right here as well as the four by fours this is a four by four I think it's a four by four and then you have these sentiments here Season's greetings, Merry Christmas, love it. And you have these. And the reverse side is this pretty pattern. I should have gotten two of these because I want to make like gingerbread houses. And that will be perfect for that. This one's called Sugar Plums, as you can see here. Lots of sugary treats. And then the reverse has the snowflakes in this kind of aqua color. And then you have the uh, season's greetings. And these are the tags. So cute. Doodlebug is just adorable. 
perfect for your mini albums, right? And for Christmas presents, of course, and I love that they have the top, uh, you know, in the pattern paper for the tag. Then this one is the Hello Santa. I think I'm missing, I might be missing a couple of papers. I think this Cookies for Santa one I'm missing and the paper gift wrap, and that's the striped one. But um, that's okay. Yeah, he ran out, so Frank ran out. Um, but what I mainly went there for was I had to have this <laughs> right here. I'm sure I have a, a gingerbread house die somewhere. Um, but I really like this one because um, I'll show you in a minute when I flip it over. But this is... Um, it's called Gingerbread Lane, so um, you can create all of these using this die right here. And it's about this, I think it's the same size here. Yeah, I really wanted to see how big this gingerbread house is, and it's tiny. It's only about, um, the widest uh, is three and three quarter, and then the tallest, including the chimney, is three a little bit over three and a half. Yeah, it's like three and five eighths. But it's so cute. Um, it is a little pricey, $26.99, but I did get my 10% coupon and I didn't have to pay for shipping. So that's, you know, that's a bonus there. But what I love about it is, can you see? There's layering pieces. So you can cut your, you know, you can cut this in the brown color for your gingerbread and then this base white because then you can see the frosting. I think it, it lines up. Um, and even the cupcakes, you have all these layering p pieces. Like this would be whatever color your cupcake is going to be. And then whatever your frosting is going to be, you cut it with this. And then the, the cupcake cup or liner is this one right here and then you have the cherry and then the sprinkles would be like any of these right here um, it's just so cute you just have layering pieces like even with a lollipop you have you know the layering um, the stick for the lollipop and you have two different size lollipops as well so you get two peppermint um, layers here it's adorable it's so cute I had to have it so yeah that was the main reason why I went there because I wanted to get this one so it came out to about 24 a little bit over $24 for this one and then um, since you know he was out of like a lot of the doodle pops and sprinkles and um, puffy stickers um, I decided to just get the mini icons he did have the icon stickers but they are a little bit bigger and he did have the chit chats as well as the odds and ends. But I find that sometimes they're just too big for my projects. So I decided to do the mini icons. And so you get these pieces. And do you see the striped here? You can use that for your candy. Um, like the, uh, what are these? Like the columns right here or the, the striped? column because it doesn't give you the the stripe layer it only cuts the stick or the column here and I thought oh look this is perfect it's striped right you can use them um, this um, I guess it'd be a sticker paper for that purpose so anyway just an idea so look at all the cute stuff oh my gosh I'm gonna show you guys the other two because you get two more pages Oh my gosh, so cute. So, so, so cute. Okay, let's open it up because these are designed for your planners, I guess. But, you know, you can use it for not just your planners. You can use them for your embellishments. I think there's just the one. So this is um, the other one. So it has the jars because this one I think didn't have the jars. And the cupcake and the little cloche there 
And then the other one that you haven't seen is this one. This has the the mug and the apron, the little house, and oh my gosh, look at that. <laughs> How cute is that? Ah. <laughs> Too, too adorable and the choo-choo train the caboose oh my gosh adorbs adorbs and that's it that's all I got um, from the I was gonna say doodlebug kisses but that's the gingerbread kisses now I also fell in love with another collection which I didn't even know about until I was searching on Frank Garcia studio um, online and I found this collection. I did not even know about this one. This is by Paige Evans. And I think it came out a couple of months ago, but I did not know about it. It's called Sugar Plum Wishes. Everything's wishes, huh? You got gingerbread, <laughs> peppermint, sugar plum wishes. <laughs> anyway, so there are 24 designs. And um, I got the, the double-sided papers so uh you know it's only 12 papers um but there are 24 designs so these are the tags this will be number one and she has it numbered up here just so you know which one you're getting love that one and i love that she has purples in this which is not your traditional um Christmas colors but it's still really pretty the back is very busy I will probably maybe just fussy cut some of these flowers I don't know I obviously can't use this um, for the tag but um, it's really pretty but if you guys know Paige Evans her papers are usually very very busy um, but I love the vibrant colors and I just fell in love so this is number two super pretty you have the green background and then the poinsettia and um, some candy canes and then the reverse side um, is the plaid then you have this one here this is number three and you have this um, knitted sweater and then the reverse side is this blue uh, green plaid and I got two of those because it's so pretty. And then this one is number four and it has the scene. It has a snowy scene, which you can absolutely fussy cut as well. And the reverse side has some um, fun sentiments that you can also fussy cut if you wanted. And then this is um, one of my favorites right here. It has the sugar cookies and it has the pink background and then it has the polka dots on the reverse side then you have this one right here full of florals and pine cones um, and then you have another plaid in kind of a pink and also red and this has got to be my very very favorite I love the red it's so pretty with all the candy canes and um, gingerbread and you know uh, candy and then look at that beautiful stripe so pretty I love it I had to get two of those as well because I just have to um, have both both sides and then if you're doing a December daily you can use these um, these are not quite two by twos are they let me see I think they're a little bit bigger than a two by two. It's like two and, uh, let's see, one, two, three, not quite four eighths. It's almost two and a half, but it's like two and three eighths, a little bit more than three eighths, I think. And then you have all these patterns here, and of course the numbers. And some of them she spells out, as you can see here, 11 and 13 instead of the actual number. And then the reverse side has the holly and berries. And then you get another sweater pattern. And how beautiful is this? Oh my gosh, I love it so much. It's, the, it's such a pretty purple. 
and then the reverse side has some snowflakes and then you have um, these right here the ornaments these are like the old-fashioned ornaments that's what they look like to me and you got bows and candy and then the reverse side and I am loving this this um, um, very bright green uh, what is this green it's like it's um, it just escapes me right now but it's like super bright um, you can use this for Halloween actually <laughs> and I had to have two of those because I really like that green lime lime green is what I wanted to say and then you have all these trees oh my gosh look at all these different types of trees different colors too the reverse side is this beautiful stripe and then you have um, this one right here with the different pattern paper that you can fussy cut if you wanted to or um, punch out and they just look like swatches right <laughs> and then the reverse side has um, the stockings hanging and that's it and then you have 60 foam stickers so um, she has like a full 12 by 12 um, inch foam stickers and sorry for the glare but I'll try to show you this way and look how pretty I think it's so cute and I love 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 the colors and um, this one is $7.99 I'm sorry, I didn't. I might not have given you all the prices. Of course, the papers are a dollar ten, I think. And I did also get some of the embellishments, um, as well as the the album. And um, this is a really nice album. It, it's bigger than I thought it was going to be because it said six by eight. But the album itself, it's going to house a 6x8. Um, um, it comes with the page protectors, but um, it's actually like 9 and a quarter. I think it's 9 and a quarter by 9 and a quarter. Not quite. <clears throat> but it's about 9 and a quarter and then 9 and, I don't know, 2 eighths. But it's pretty big and you get three of the full page, the half pages, you know, the plastic covers. As you can see there, that's what you get on the inside. So this one is a little pricey. It's $29.99, but you get all the, you know, it's a full album, so you don't have to do the cover or anything. And the inside has um, pink polka dots. So I just decided to get it because I don't want to have to, you know, make my cover. And then um, I did get some of the embellishments I got this one right here I did not get the florals though I just thought it was gonna be too much you know and I'm gonna end up not using them um, but these are the ones I got I could always fussy cut some flowers if I wanted to from the papers these are mostly like sentiments and tags I mean you get the little some little icons there too um, but I got the puffy stickers as well. Look how cute. So, so cute. Again, look at the sweater. It's so cute. And, um, this was, this one is $4.99 for the puffy stickers, $5.99 for the embellishments. And I decided to get the tassels because it's nice to just have it done. You know, there's a penguin, there's a, a house, and there's a sweater. I can just get it. It's a green sweater. These are metal too, you guys, just so you know. They're like metal. I don't know if it's enamel on top. And then you have a stocking as well. So you get these tassels. The tassels are $8.99. Um, these acrylic embellishments, you get nine of them, and also some, um, what are these? <laughs> um, sequins. Pretty sequins, right? But look at the sweaters. So cute. And the sweaters are acrylic. 
Uh, this one is $7.99. I had to get the paper clips. You get six of them. And those are the paper clips, different colors with different um, dangles on them. So cute. Just to give you some ideas if you want to create your own too. So totally inspiring. $8.99. And then last but not least, I got the cross stitch kit. Now, I don't really do cross stitching, but um, I think she might have a tutorial on this. Hopefully she will, but um, I figure it can't be that hard, right, to cross stitch. Um, but it comes with all the, th the thread. Uh, is it called a thread? Um... I know it's called something else. It's not floss, right? Anyway. <laughs> um, but yeah, they already have the hole. So you get all of these different um, different colored Christmas trees. And then it has the holes. And you just, you know, do your cross stitch. Isn't that adorable? It's so cute. And you get even the needle. And there's all the colors of the thread, so I guess it matches the collection. So that one was $6.99, so I thought that wasn't too bad. That is um, Paige Evans' new Christmas collection. I think this is her very first Christmas collection, too, if I'm not mistaken. Um, and that is called uh, Sugar Plum Kisses. All right, guys. Thank you so much for stopping by my channel, and I hope you guys have a wonderful week. I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.